So the hatch is starting, and you can see them everywhere. And the bugs are coming back and hitting the top of the water so they can swim down. So now's a good time to maybe put the indicator back in. But sometimes they're going to stay down because it's not windy, and you can just drag through that top foot with uh, a different fly, whether it's a leech or whatever. So I'm going to just drag the indicator through these little hatches. Or not the indicator, sorry, I'm just going to drag the intermediate through them. Because at least there'll be fish in there and they can make up their mind if they want it or not. Rather than trying to fish the exact, the exact hatch, which isn't a bad way to go. But, I mean, those are like size 24 flies, caddis coming back in. They're all small. Did you notice how little they are? Looks like a little piece of almost. It's kind of cool to see those little micro hatches, huh? There's one right there. See? Just dragged it. No, I just went back to the type one and I drug right through that hatch. See, what the, see how the water's all ringing up? Just cast over as far into it as you can or to the other side. And just give it a 10 count and then start pulling back in. Because they're going to come in there to eat those bugs. So you're not matching the hatch. We're just throwing into it. Because we know the fish are going to be there. We're giving them a... Giving them a little bit more of a morsel than a size 24, you know. This was a little bit better one. Yeah. Definitely a little bit better of one. It's one of them thicker, meatier ones. Saw that bug and he's like, that looks a little bit more tasty. <laughs> wow. Y'all, I forgot that the chunkier ones in here put up such a good fight. I better reel some of that in. My heck. This is a good one for here. I've got my strap stuck on my fly box over here. I thought I was just going to get him up to the tube real quick, but he has other plans. I don't think these fish realize we're going to let him go. Let me just swim up here and open his mouth. Right? We'll have to teach him the drill for next time. He keeps, yeah, he keeps trying to swim back at me. Probably just been caught a couple times and he knows if he can find a log or a stick or something. Come on. Uh, he's not even that big. That was a good fight for that fish. He's not tiny, but... Huh? For here. See if I can get the fly out of there. Whoops. Try to do it nice. Okay. Alright, well. Give him a bit of a rest there. He catches breath. The water's a little bit warm today, so I'll make sure we get the fish back in there. Nice and revived. Some good footage of them. Yeah, if I was hungry, I'd probably eat that one. Look at that guy, Cart. That's a nice one. Let's see if he's ready. Yep, away he goes. 
out of here. That was a pretty fish. He was all finned up and colored in.